this is Tracy from Gift Basket Appeal. And looking at this bag, yep, I went to Goodwill. So I'm doing a Goodwill haul. So let's get started. I'm just so amazed the amount of cool stuff you can find at the Goodwill. And so I went to a, a Goodwill that was over in Sandy Springs, Georgia. And I don't live like really close, close by there. But when, since I was over there, I thought, you know what? I may as well stop in the Goodwill. So I found a few things that I'd like to share with you. Look at this. This is a tile and it's painted. Um, and it's just so pretty. And so when I saw it, I was like, oh, I have to have it. And it cost a dollar and 51 cents. So even if I wanted to change out the ribbon, I could. Or I can just leave it like that and hang it as a decoration. Or I think this would be nice to give as a gift too. Faith, hope, and love. So this, I really like words. So, um, and I love flowers. So this is a mix of both. And I like polka dots. So it has dots on it as well. So I'll probably keep this somewhere where I can look at it. And I like the colors. I also found this box. And I thought there's so much you can do with it. And this costs a dollar and 21 cents. And I could Mod Podge it, I could paint it, and then I could put something on the inside maybe to decorate it. And I thought this would be really pretty. I can put some lace ribbon on it. Um, so there's so much you can do with this. Kind of shabby chic it, maybe add some flowers to it also. So I'm gonna have so much fun with this. So you'll, of course, you'll be seeing it in the video. Let's see. I also found a wooden shadow box. How cool is this? And they had a ton of stuff there um, in this section, a whole bunch of wooden stuff together in one area. And I had never seen so much uh, things like this. This was 99 cents. This is such a bargain. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna be doing something in um, with this shadow box. I think those paper flowers that I've done before would look really pretty in here. This would be nice for hanging. Um, let's see. Yeah, this would be pretty nice for hanging on, on something. You know, hanging on a wall with some pretty flowers uh, would be pretty. And of course, those paper flowers would be perfect for this. So. Got my wooden shadow box, and this is seven inches by 7.5 inches. So I think that's a really good, good bargain. I also found some of this. This was 99 cents, and it's 80 sheets. Uh, it's a to-do it's a to-do pad, but I could always take the magnet and do something on here different. I can take all of these strips off, use them in a lot of my projects as well. So I like that because it has the uh, C, sh um, like the uh, a C theme on there, and so I thought this would be really cute to do some stuff with. So we will see what happens with this. Stay tuned. This will be great for mini books too. Then I found this Make It Christmas, um, and I thought this would be cute because these have like a little hanging thing on it, so you could either hang it. Um, but you don't have to. You can attach it to something else with a background. You can decorate it and attach it maybe to a uh, flower box filled with poinsettias. Um, I can kind of upcycle a project using this. So there's so many different ideas going through my head. Now this was originally $5.99, but at Goodwill, 99 cents. And look how big they are. So you can hang them up as Christmas decorations or you can I think it'll be really cute, maybe making a frame for it. So I'm just thinking all these ideas that are coming to me just from this one thing. I also found some, um, it's a letter set and it's got 10 pages in it and five envelopes, I, said, I think it says, yep. Yeah. And it's so pretty. Um, I don't know if you can see the little speckles in there. Sorry for the glare. But I could either cut these up and use them in uh, maybe some junk journals. Still, since I'm learning and I'm trying to teach myself how to do the junk journals and maybe the mini books. But I thought it was really cute with the matching envelopes in there, too. And the artwork is so cute. I love that artwork. 
Yep, and this was 77 cents. Can't beat that. And then I found, I found this cutting board and it's already been used, but I thought for dollar and 91 cents, and this is Onita, this is a good brand actually. I, uh, someone had asked me um, to, if I could Mod Podge a cutting board. So I think that's gonna be a great project for this. And the nice thing is um, you can have it maybe sitting uh, in your kitchen somewhere or uh, you can hang it in your kitchen. I think it'll be a nice decoration and another nice gift idea. And they had a lot of cutting boards. So you can actually just kind of make it your own, uh, paint it, do whatever you want with it. Uh, you could even, even put it this way and kind of decorate it. Maybe, I don't know, with the family name on it or... You know, I could put Tracy's Kitchen or something. I don't know. I'm just thinking different ideas. Yep. And then I found, let's see, I found this watercolor paint set. And it's a 19 piece. It's originally $9.99. You're not going to believe how much I got this for. A dollar and 91 cents. And then I thought maybe there's some pieces missing out of it. And I love the little wooden box also. Nothing missing. It's a full set. Look at all of the, the uh, colors. I think this is a bargain. Yep, and I've seen these pencils before. But it is from Master's Touch Fine Art Studio. And I think this is really cute. You can find some really great gifts. Um, and the paint brushes also. So I'm really loving this. And here's the palettes. And look at all the colors I have to play with. And I think I have some watercolor paper somewhere around here. So I'm going to have to look for that and start maybe doing some watercoloring. It's got the eraser, a sharpener, a sponge. Oh, I didn't see the sponge. Let's see. Oh, there it is. <laughs> yep. So another great find. Okay, and so my... My brother-in-law and my sister, they go to the Goodwill a lot. And they were thinking of me, and look what they found. You're not going to believe this. I have to kind of turn this box a little bit. Let me just show you. I'm going to start pulling some stuff out. They brought me a bag of stuff, and I had to transfer this stuff to a box. Look at this. Ribbon. They know me well. All of this ribbon they found and I mean they found this in just one uh, one trip to the uh, to Goodwill and so they found buttons ribbon let me just put this on the side here these are some decorative uh, some pearl snap fasteners I don't know how I'm going to use it, but guess what? I'm going to hold on to these. Y'all tell me how you would use these if you do use them. And do I need something special to fasten those? I haven't opened it up yet, but um, I think I'm going to really like these. And they bought me some buttons, and these buttons have an anchor on them. So this will be cute on some kind of uh, male type, male inspired project. It's got the anchor, maybe something for sailing or an ocean theme. Look at all this that they found. Buttons, some gems, more of those snap fasteners. I'm trying to go through this really quick so I can show you. Look at this. Just all types of ribbon, all sizes. And the thing is that Ofray brand, and I think it was like the total cost for like all of that stuff, just the ribbons and stuff. Uh, plus they brought me some material also. I think it was like $5, somewhere around that price for all of this stuff. So it's like they had them just all bagged up in the same bag and they just bought the whole bag, $5. Look at that, buttons. I can always like always use buttons in my stuff. Look how gorgeous this is. This is so pretty. I'm thinking some spring projects. More ribbon. More ribbon. 
this is ribbon that's um it's a wired ribbon it's so dainty and pretty and so it's got a little sheerness to it if that's a word <laughs> it's a sheer wired ribbon celebrate it i've seen this somewhere before i'm not sure if i've seen it at hobby lobby maybe and some of it has been used already but it still works it still works here's another pretty ribbon sheer I mean, they really found me a bunch of stuff. Uh, some 100 eyelet refills. Not sure what that is, but I can, I've can. i seen this on something before. Someone tell me what these could be used for. Just, just check it. And look at all of this. I mean, they're so wonderful to think of me when, when they go to um, Goodwill. This is why I love thrifting and finding bargains and stuff, because crafting shouldn't be that expensive. Look at this soccer theme ribbon. Isn't that the cutest? That is so cute. I see that decorating something. And here's more green. So I have all kinds of colors here. Lots of mini bows can be made from these. I'm just rum rummaging through this box. More buttons. More, more of the ribbons. I mean, you can do a ribbon haul with all of this stuff. Look at this. Different colors. This hasn't even been opened yet. This is from Ofre. That's another brand that's real popular. I've seen that at Walmart. And more ribbon. Hmm. This is pretty. That, that shade of green is really nice. Seeing if y'all could see that. And let's see what else we got in here. Oh, we got an animal print ribbon here. So cute. Let's see what else we have here. Almost to the bottom of this box. I promise. <laughs> Look at that. This is going to be really nice for decorating all kinds of stuff. I could even decorate cards with this. But I like the way that kind of um, curves like that, you know, add texture to your cards. Lots of black thin ribbon, which is nice. That really thin, thin ribbon will be pretty. I can use this to help um, close up some of those mini books also. I keep talking about mini books. I know I've, I've just been enjoying making those. And look at this. So don't forget to go over to that uh, area where they have the fabrics and stuff and, and find yourself some, see if you can find some ribbon. Oh, more of this, the animal print ribbon. And this is uh, the Ribbon Boutique. I've seen that before. I, went, I think I've seen that at uh, Hobby Lobby possibly. And look at this, look how pretty that is. Look how fun. And you can mix your, mix and match some of your ribbon. You don't have to, you can layer, layer them. If you have a, a wider plain ribbon, you can layer it with another ribbon um, just to make it real fun. So just, just a thought, more orange. And I guess that is it. Look how much stuff this is. Um, and what a bargain. I would never be able to get this amount of ribbon for $5 and under. It's just not going to happen. So um, I hope this was helpful. Uh, if you ever go to Goodwill, uh, let me know what crafty items you like to look for. And that way I can be looking too. Because I know I, I'm always surprised at how many crafty things they have there. So I will see you real soon. And thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't subscribed to our crafty family yet, please go ahead and subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you real soon. Bye.